So now to scale keyframes in the time slider. Very handy to do because you might want to do that. Just say increase the time here. So we could grab these keys over there and move that. And that's one way of doing it. But perhaps this action here, we want it to be quite a bit faster. So rather than grabbing each frame and then moving them over one by one, which we can easily do, but it just takes a while and it might not retain the spacing that they have. We can do it in a few ways. The first one is we just hit the R, which is scale mode here. And then we middle click drag with the shift held down again on that point or as close as we can to it. And now we can scale that from that point. So wherever we click is where we are actually scaling from. So if I select that key, we can come over here in the middle and we can actually scale from the middle or we can scale from that side. So the shift is very important because otherwise it's actually, you don't have to hold down shift by the looks of it, just whatever way we're going first. But it is important because we can scale on value as well as scale on time that way. Really good one to know.